Game death match. We're back! What's up, attentive gamers? This is Flare Rider bringing you wonderful, wonderful news. It has happened. It has finally happened. Although I must admit, I didn't really put out all that much effort up until just recently. Anyway, Potenza has made its real return. This time we've come back better, faster, and stronger than ever before. Okay, maybe not so much, but you know, we try. I know this was said, or something like this was said, around about a year ago, around somewhere around this time, or something, I don't know. Anyway, this time I promise we're back for the remainder. Now on to business. I have plans. Yep. As usual, I have plans. Don't know what those plans are just yet, but they're rattling around in the old noggin. As of now, I am part of two different channels and my own, so figuring out stuff for three channels is challenging already. First being this one, Potenza. That came first. It just kind of stopped. Inbound. Then we have mine, which really came first. And then we have, wait for it, Magikarp Gaming. Magikarp consists of four people, including myself. We have... Super GameCube 64, Sir Man Guy Dude, and Pity Flame. But enough about the carps. Let's see. You may notice that I dip into subjects, then bounce around, and then directly come on out of them. Yeah, I have a habit of doing that, and no intention on breaking it, so deal with it, you know, because stuff. Now, for this video. This is my first best game in Blobs 2. This was probably when I... No, this was when I was working on getting my diamond camos for my pistols. This was my first goal in Blobs 2. I didn't make, even make it past the second prestige before I had diamond. Oh, and of course, people who were jealous accused me of boosting since I had diamond so soon. <clears throat> but in all honesty, I didn't really have any friends that I played with on uh, Blobs 2 at a time, except... Uh, by Koi, which now he's B3 Koi. I don't remember what his gamer tag back then was, but uh, yeah, he's he's one of those who uses his snipers all the time. So he had really no intentions on boosting, even if I wanted to. But um, let's see. The, the the executioner was actually the hardest pistol to get because of its horribleness. I actually, uh, I don't remember when, but, you know, like, maybe a month after I got my pistols diamond, they came out with, a, no, not even a month, more like two weeks after I got my pistols diamond, they came out with a patch for the executioner that buffed the gun, of course, right? So I got my diamond pre-buff, which is pretty badass, if I do say so. <clears throat> So, yeah, but to this day, my weapon of choice, or for you Halo fans out there, Tool of Destruction, although I'm not really sure what a Halo fan would be doing watching COD, you know, since uh, Halo fans usually hate COD and vice versa. I just happen to be one of those who like most games, except Batman and sports and most fighters. Bring on the hate! Anyway, I digress. My favorite weapon with most kills and stuff is 5.7. I won't even touch the Cap 40 or this game's Rafika wannabe. But the only reason I have any kills with them is because I wanted that diamond. But to me, it just seems wrong to let a trigger finger like mine go to waste with a full auto or burst shot pistol. I do use full auto assault rifles, <clears throat> excuse me, but mostly, mostly use the FAL. Every now and again I use subs, but I don't like using them. I will if I have to, kind of like, you know, in league matches because that's all people ever use you know because subs are like super OP and shit for some reason I don't understand it <clears throat> um, I've been a fan of the semi-auto since NW2 but never never was a really big fan of COD 4 I mean don't get me wrong don't get me wrong it's a good game it's a good game I just didn't really get into COD until NW2 in all honesty, Flops 2 is probably one of the better and newer CODs. Well, it, of course it is the newer one, but it's one of the better CODs. Contrary to popular belief, I thought Modern Warfare 3 was an alright game. Horribly unbalanced, but fun to play with friends. And just dick around and shit. 
not really caring about Call of Duty Ghost, and while everyone is arguing about next-gen consoles, I'm just sitting here playing Animal Crossing because zero fucks were given this day. And uh, we are actually wrapping up the video now, which was wonderful timing on my part. So thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment, like, and subscribe, and welcome back to the Potenza channel. We are here to stay.